Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Disgaea PC. In the last episode, Laharl finally got his wish of becoming Overlord. So now let's see what he does with this newfound title. <laughs> Jeez, you just keep laughing and laughing. How can I not? I'm now the Overlord. That means that I'm the most eminent demon in all of the Netherworld. I am aware of that. But ever since you've become the Overlord, you have done nothing but laugh. You don't understand a thing. Laughing is a very important aspect of being the Overlord. Besides, there isn't any urgent matter that's suitable for my first act as King Laharl the Terrible. Oh, Prince! I got a job for ya! Call me your highness! I'm the overlord now! Aw, come on! That's a minor detail. Minor detail? So, what kind of job is it? You want me to make it rain pepper on Earth so they can't stop sneezing? Or do you want me to give human kids an addictive video game that will deprive them of their sleep? Uh, no. Come in, Aramis! this kid? Don't call me a kid. You're more of a kid yourself. What? Who the hell do you think I am? Now, now. He is just a child. Shut up, black chest. <coughs> what did you say, you? <gasps> I mustn't. At times like this, love is the answer. With love, there is understanding. Hey, does she have a few screws loose or something? Huh, you got some attitude, kid. Just like you, Prince. Yeah, right. So, what's he got to do with the job? Oh, yeah, his pets are missing. Hmm? And? And your job's to look for them. Why would I, the Overlord, look for some stupid little brat's pets? Ridiculous! Absolutely ridiculous! Bring me something more fitting for my first task as Overlord! I refuse. It may seem ridiculous to you, but it's important to him. This is a perfect way to begin your rule as Overlord. And if you don't do it, I'm never going to accept you as the Overlord. What, what are you getting so mad for? It's not like you. Answer me. Will you do it or not? Oh, fine. I'll do it. I'll do it. Good. And you better not slack off. Ugh. Why am I, the overlord of the netherworld, taking orders from this annoying brat? Episode 7 of Being an Overlord. Laharl, we have no idea why you're taking orders from this, ahem, <clears throat> little brat, but all we can know for sure is something's probably, like, he probably has some secret up his sleeve, otherwise why would Edna actually advocate for him? Like, right? It has to be. Also, any new items here? Uh, no, just these things. I do need healing items, so... Let's just buy all of these. Uh, I don't think I need dimensional capes, but I'm gonna buy a few of these just to bribe the freaking council with. Those are all in my inventory, right? No, I have healing items here. Uh, probably should work on upgrading equipment now, but... Eh? I see, wait. First off, equip... Does everyone have, like, good equipment now? You don't, so I can easily just, like, strap on. There we go, back to equipment. Give you, like, I don't know. Not fancy. Yeah, this fancy lid. And, I don't know, some chain mail? Anyone? Yeah, you can have just two-dimensional capes. You can have... You'll lose HP, but you get, like, so much of everything else, so... Uh... 
You know what, let's swap the amulet out, because this is just going to be a net positive, no matter what we swap it out for. Yep, this, this, that can stay. Okay. I think that's all we need to do for these guys, because... Uh, muscle trainer... Yeah, I lose HP, but I get other stuff, so... There we go. Now I could just swap out things. Like, bad equipment and such. Got fancy lid. Fancy lid. Chain mail. You know what? I could bring chocolate. It doesn't matter. I just need stuff to throw at the council members. Because otherwise, they're just going to tell me no to everything. And I can't have them telling me no. Uh, yep, bulletproof vest. Muscle victory. I probably shouldn't be giving away muscle victories now that I think about it. So, mint gum? Yeah, I definitely don't need mint gum. I think leather jackets are definitely worth more than mint gum. So, again, leather jackets, you also stay behind. Okay, this seems like a good stuff to bring. Okay, I need to just... La Harl? Uh, more expensive stuff. I still want better shop items. Uh, I'll be back when I'm actually gonna start... Okay, total support. Strongly for... Leaning yes. Strongly for... Strongly... Leaning yes. Leaning yes. Strongly... In favor, in favor. Either way, no, we can't. So yeah, I'll be back when we actually start doing stuff. So I may go to like item world and such to grind up. But until then, I'll see you guys in a, in a quick moment. Well, I'm back from one trip to the item world. Did not pay out as I was expecting, but oh well. We'll go back into the actual story. Have you heard what's been happening at Salamander's Breath? Supposedly, there's been a flood of zombies recently. Zombies, huh? Could it be that Armin's pet has been eaten by zombies? That or his pets are zombies. One of the two. What did this kid sound like? Ah, oh, Miss Etna. That's one of my pets over there. Why is he only polite to you? It's all about the special training I gave him. Oh, I get it. It's the power of love. Sure, whatever you say. A zombie? A zombie it is. Hey, Brad, don't tell me this is one of your pets. Yes, you got a problem with that? No, actually, I like it. You got good taste, kid. A zombie for a pet, huh? So, how do we catch it? Why not do the same thing we always do? I guess that would work. I mean, zombies are already dead anyway. Then let me. Then let the massacre begin. Agreed. Um, are you sure that's okay? Uh, okay, let's try to get Loharl here. Special, Winged Slayer. Yo, that gets a lot of them. Uh, Etna, if you can get... Oh, that's exactly where I wanted you to be. Somewhere... No, you need to be one step forward. There we go. Because now we can Asteroid Drop on these fools. Uh, sure, I'll put you in position to where you could then hit all of those. And, yeah, you can come over here. And let's just do a quick little bunny meteor. And then, I don't think that's going to kill, so Lucy, you come out. Same with you, Trucy. However, you're going to use magic boost. Yeah, level 1 on you. And then you mega fire. Level 3. And Shabada Bingo, Shabada Bango. This hopefully will get a kill on everything in this entire map. Oh wait, there were three enemies I just completely overlooked. Ooh, that didn't actually get a kill. Which means this probably won't get a kill. Oh yeah, that did not kill. Okay, but those three up there are definitely going to die. 
because this magic boosted mega fire should definitely get a kill. Oh no. Uh can we like do you have anything that can actually like pierce enemies? Okay, this is effectively the asteroid drop. So can't go for that. This definitely can't do. Uh I guess we'll attack here. You could come down one and poison arrow, I guess. We don't really have much attack. Oh wait, Glep. Glep has access to a special. Let's go, Glep. You got this. Uh, Hogmiser. You come up here and try to blow another one away. And we just need someone to take a... Like, create a wall here. Okay, we can't get more than this. So you come here just so they have a harder time hitting our healer. Okay, that didn't get a kill, but come on, Hell Pepper. It's probably, it's definitely not gonna get a kill, but it'll poison everything. So, and turn. Yeah, this is about how I expected this to go. Zombie Twister, Glep's dead. Oh no, our healer is definitely dead after this. Oh wait, no, our healer is tanky as all get out. Never mind. Uh, does this kill our mage? No, doesn't look like it. This one might go. Yeah. Okay, but we do have a way to pretty much ignore all the enemies in our... Not enemies, allies in our path to get kills on, so... Yay. Counter also just helps. Give us a bit of extra damage. Go, someone died. You have how much? 99? Uh, yeah, you come over here for now. We'll figure out where you actually go later. Special, wind cutter. Okay, you need to be one forward. Because this way, wind cutter hits three enemies and no allies. And shoot. Okay, that means Hogmiser should be able to get a kill here. Good, good. Uh, Polinaire should be able to get a kill on these two if I put that there. Which means you, not that. Actually, you know what? We will Tiger's Charge once we move Edna out the way. Edna, you come down here and Paler this guy. You, Tiger Charge. Uh, you, Mega Ice. Oh, we don't need to use level 2 to actually have that Mega Ice connect. But it's full HP. Yeesh. Okay, that should be fine though. Also, what is this one doing? So that's the experience. Okay, they're all active right now. It doesn't matter. Special. Uh, what is... That doesn't actually hit. I would need to be one back, one down. Which I can accomplish. Move. Uh, okay, I need to be where Edna's standing, so... Execute everything first. Because then Edna should be out of position of where she currently is. Which means we can move there and actually use our special for once. Come on, Tiger Charge, get a kill. No kill. Okay, well. We don't need to use our special because we could just come down here and attack. Which should get a kill. I was wrong. But this should though, because our arch not archer, our mage has like ridiculous damage. And you oh, you can I don't know, you can still use an item? That's weird. But no, we can't. Okay. Hopefully we can level up our Mage Trucy a bit. 
Never mind. Did I say I want to level up Trucy? I mean, she deserved to drop dead. No one liked her anyway. Uh, but we do need the Prince to get more kills. If for no reason other than the fact that, hey, we need to craft a dragon sooner or later. Uh, let's see, this year should actually be able to let us use our special, right? Hey, perfect. Anything that lives will be taken care of by our other three main party members. Okay, I wasn't expecting everything to live. Okay, Edna, you need to come down this way. Get a kill, please. Uh, Hogmiser, you could get a kill. And, okay, good. Everything's working out as planned. Kind of. Special proximity shot. And, I believe your, your basic attack should get a kill. There we go. Sadly, no dragon family crafted after this chapter, but it's fine. Oh, you lived. We still have one party member, though, so... You're dead. Whew. That's one zombie captured. Uh, I'll continue off in the next episode, so until then, I'll be in the item world grinding items up. Probably trying to get our rest of our party member up to La Harl at Nam Planaire's level. Like, I want everyone to be at least in their 20s. Everyone who's used at least. So that's like, probably gonna be Glep, Hogmiser, Trucy, Rouge, Flan, Lucy, and that'll probably be it. And then if I could form a dragon, that'll also be like, grind it up to level 20. We can make it good for nothing, but I want at least an incompetent, if not better. So I'll see you all in the next episode where everyone's equipment is going to be grinded up. Mainly going to be these dimensional capes that everyone's wearing. Like at least one piece of armor on everyone is going to be grinded up. So until then, bye for now.